through question four. I want the systematic names of these compounds here. And as you can see, the solution is, I don't know what they're talking about here. I think it's a maybe transcription error or something like that, but I can't read that. So um, yeah, so let's just, I guess let's just, just problem together then. I, the solution is probably a different format. So I have here a lot of systematic names for compounds here. So A, I have CUIS. B is Fe2O3 solid. C is CO F2. And D here is FeOS. So all these guys here are going to be, um, they're all multivalent metals. So the, this metal here, multivalent, 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 which means they can exist in one or two more charges. So we need to figure out, okay, how do we figure out uh, these charges here? So what I would do here is I can kind of think of this as I can dissociate or break down these compounds into its ion form. So I have Cu plus an I minus on this one. I have Fe something, I don't know this charge here, and O two minus. Well, um, in this case for copper, for A here, let me go back to copper here. Um, I know it's one plus here because I'm gonna have to balance this one minus charge here, right? So that so this, um, I would have a charge of uh, one plus here. If I have a two minus charge here, if I do the crisscross method, uh, O3 uh, would make a three plus on the iron, right? So I would have three plus here, and this would be two minus. CO, I have F minus here, and this F has a two a coefficient of two, so therefore cobalt should have a charge of two plus. And then FeO, FO here has, I have a charge of two minus, which means iron has a charge of two plus. So if I know the charges of these guys, I can simply write down the name, right? So for example, this guy here is copper. Let's use copper, and the charge here is a one. So I have to write, indicate the charge, copper one, iodide. So very similar to how we uh, label ionic compounds because we have a metal and non-metal, but we, in this case here, we have to also label or uh, denote the charge here. This one would be Fe, which is iron. And then I have a three charge, three oxide. This would be CO, which is cobalt. This would be two and then fluoride. And then finally, this one would be iron two oxide. So these guys here are the systematic compounds or the systematic names for these compounds. So I'm going to say uh, formatting issue with solution. And I'll just type it out. A is copper one iodide. B is iron three oxide. C is cobalt two fluoride. And D is iron two oxide. <clears throat> and the solution in here is incorrect because I can't see the solution. This is number four. <laughs>